Hey guys, Fabulik here today, and welcome back to Roller Coaster Tycoon. Uh, I say welcome back to you because I think I, I think I think I've done a few videos in the past. I've never done that many on Roller Coaster Tycoon One, uh, but I mean, with all of this Planet Coaster hype, I was just like, you know what? I really want to go back to the game that started this whole genre of theme park, uh, you know, theme park building games. Uh, and I say genre, but there's only like. What, three different games in the genre. Anyway, I just really, really wanted to play. I mean, look at the look at the menu. This was my childhood. This game. I mean, it's so exciting to see it again. I mean, just this menu gets me excited. I mean, imagine looking at this. Like, uh, when I don't even know when this came out. Ninety nine. Usually it has like a copyright here somewhere. I don't know. Does it have it in here somewhere? Is that like an about or something? Maybe like the little tutorial thing. I don't. Know. I don't. Oh, okay. Wait, what happened? They like. Oh, okay, like, it... Ah, okay, <laughs> it's going... It's going to, like, a forced full screen, and the mouse is moving It's Okay, I don't... Shouldn't have clicked that. Okay, whoops, uh, 2000, I think, is when it came out. No, that that doesn't even seem right, but that's what the copyright said. Maybe that was the last expansion. I feel... No, that's... That can't, 2000 can't be right. Uh, you know what? I don't, I don't believe it. Roller Coaster Tycoon 1 release date. I don't... Surely it's not too... 1999. That's what I thought. I was right. My intuition was correct. Uh, the last expansion was probably... Because we, we got both expansions on here. Corkscrew Follies and uh, Loopy Landscapes. Uh, which I think they came out probably 2000. Right. Anyway, without further ado... I don't know why I said it like that. Let's start a new game. I don't want to do Forest Frontiers. I mean, I always do that one. Ah, oh, damn it. I thought I was going to get... To at least look at... Uh, how do I get back to the main... I always... Quit game? Nope, quit game just quits it. How do I get to the main menu? Turns out I don't know how to play this game because I keep quitting it and all that kind of stuff. Uh, real parks. Ooh, Alton Towers. Um, no, I think, uh, why don't, let's go with one of the, the default ones. Evergreen Gardens. I don't even remember which one this is. Let's do this. Uh, convert the beautiful Evergreen Gardens into a thriving theme park. Have at least 1,000 guests in your park at the end of October year four with a park rating of at least 600. So that's actually quite a challenge. Uh, so here's our park. It looks beautiful. It's actually huge. So what I'm going to do, one thing I've learned from this game is, it, playing it in the past, is because because particularly this park is colossal um, and there's pathways everywhere, if the peeps just start wandering around, they're going to get lost. Uh, so usually what I like to do is always cut off the pathway. Does that join anywhere? This one does join somewhere as well. So what I'm going to do, I'm going to cut it off. I'll cut it off there just so we can get this pathway. Up to that point, and I think does this this also goes all the way through, which is good. But I'm just going to cut it off there. So now they're sort of just in this first little area. I don't really want to build in any of this area here because it's all uneven and it'll be super expensive. But let we will build here. That was a lie. That's a ride. Where do I get stores? Uh, these icons are foreign to me. No, it, it is in here. Okay, is it like um, is it like an information booth? No, there isn't. It's just that we. Need to make sure that, uh, let's build this, let's build this. We just need to make sure that, um, oh, I have to get rid of the tree first. Ugh, interesting. Right, is the park open? The park is open. Uh, is time progressing? No, it's not. Okay. Because uh, I kind of wanted to just pause it while we get a few things set up. Let's get a few basic rides. Uh, let's just get like, okay, well, this is really all we can do. So let's get one of these. Uh, so Z to rotate. Don't know why it's popping over there. I think I might get this back here, behind this little fence. No, you know what? Can I put it... I don't want it behind the fence, because you want it You want it visible. Let's let's put it here. That's where I was going to put it. Oh, okay. Can't build once paused. Fair enough. Well, they got me there. I guess I'm the one that's an idiot. Right, now, can I zoom in? No, I can zoom out. Oh, that's cool, actually. You can see the entire park. Perfect. So that's as far as I can zoom in. All right. Is there... I don't think there's any hot key. Oh, yeah, there is. Page up and page down is zoom in and zoom out. Okay. Well, that's good to know. Right, so the entrance, uh, we need room. So I guess there is the only place it can go. Exit can go there. We'll get that testing uh, whilst I build the queue, uh, which will be red because the ride is red. Now, I guess oh, it's going to do that thing. Oh, yeah, I forgot it does this. Where you build a pathway next to a pathway and it just joins to it. We're going to we're gonna have to remove that pathway because that's going to get in the way. Okay, let's go like this. So this will just come down. And I think we'll go back up again. Okay, can you just get rid of those trees? We'll go back up again just because I think we should do that. Uh, can I build here? Yes, I can. I thought the fence might be in the way, but I think we're good. Okay, so that will go there. 
I'll now disconnect it from that bit and that bit. So they'll come through here. Here's some guests already. So they are walking into the park. Now, if I recall, the methodology for pricing is based on the excitement and purely the excitement. So 165 free. Hang on. Are we charging for park? Because, ah, oh, we are. Can I switch this over? Yes. Okay, I'm going to make the, whoops. I'm going to make the park free, but make the rides. Just because I always find that easier to work out in this game anyway. Obviously, real life parks don't work that way. Although, I think you make more money from admission price than you do from rides. Uh, let's go about, we'll go a little bit lower because it's 1.65. Let's go $1.30. They should pay that. You'll pay it, won't you? Oh, look at them using the bathroom. They love it. Admission price free. Good. Same price throughout the park. I might as well set that. That's a good idea. Okay, let's get some, I think some food in this little area here would be really cool. Just get like a little food area. Uh, can I build there? I can. Oh, damn it, remove the fence. I didn't actually want to build there. I was just seeing if the path would work there. Uh, so this will come through the fence here though. And I'm actually just going to destroy that bit and join it up there. Yeah, I'm going to keep doing this thing where we cut off the path until we need it. Because I think that's actually a really good way to avoid people wandering around. Uh, so, I want to build this. That way. Oh, it removes the fence anyway. That's fine. Whatever. Uh, ooh, actually, no, in that case, can I... Can't start construction. Can I start now? Can I... Uh, can I damn it. Oh, my God. That wasted a lot of money. That wasted a lot of money. That's okay. That's okay. Though. I, I would rather them here. Because I don't know. I always prefer the... Uh, Oh, yeah, we should also hire some stuff. I, I was gonna say, I just prefer, I always prefer playing like, I, see, look at this. People just wander around aimlessly. And that's why we cut off the park. <gasps> no! Stop. That'll stop that person. I didn't cut off that pathway. That's okay. It should, that should stop him. Good. Oh, sneaky little bugger. <laughs> that's why we do that. Now, is anyone actually going to go on this? Or is this just not interesting? Uh, do people have any thoughts about it? I want to go on something more thrilling. Okay. Fair enough. How much? We have 8,000 bucks. Fair enough. Well, let me get the rest of the food in. Then I'll get some staff because we don't have any. Uh, let's get some ice cream. There you go. I'll get another bathroom here. I know we have one down there. I just wanted that at the beginning. Uh, we'll get another bathroom. Uh, I'll put it around the corner just so it's not, you know, right, <laughs> right in front of the food because that seems kind of gross. Uh, we'll put it there. Open that up. And we'll get a little pathway. We'll do our little trick. Disconnect it. There you go. Good. Okay, so let's get something a little bit more thrilling. Now, we don't have any other actual thrill rides. We have some coasters that we could build. We have a few of these things as well. Um, and I think I do want to start out... Oh, I don't want to do a hedge maze. Let's do... Uh, 2800 upwards. We don't have a lot of money. Let's do a junior coaster. Uh, we're going to build a custom design, of course. I'm not an idiot. Now, I think if we start over here, I'm going to make sure I leave enough room for this. I'm going to have to rotate. I never like rotating in isometric games because it always disorientates me. I'm like, where am I? My park looks entirely different. Okay, so we're going to go like this. Then we're going to go chain lift and up and up and up. Can I turn? Will it make it? Oh, you beauty. Look at that. That's actually... Wonderful. This goes like up the hill perfectly. Okay, here we go. It is supposed to... Oh, the yeah, that's the problem with Roller Coaster Tycoon 1. You can't actually test them as you're building. So we just gotta... We just gotta eyeball this and hope that it's gonna work. Alright, so we're gonna do a big drop. Move that tree. Get out of my way, get out of my way. Not, not too big, but... Um, a small turn up. It's not going to be as smooth as uh, good old Planet Coaster, but, you know, we're going to do our best. Uh, remove that tree. Okay. Now, let's go up a little bit. Just one, so we just get a little bit of air time. Then we're going to come... No, ah, can't do that. Okay, fair enough. Come down like this, and then can I do a sharp... There we go. New rider or attraction available. Spiral slide. Yes. Uh, then we're going to bank it this way. Special. Can we do, like, helix up? No, that's down. Actually, we might be able to do that. If I can get rid of some of these trees, will that fit? Oh, nice. Nice. Okay. Received an award for being the tidiest park in the... Oh, that's what I need to do. Staff. Staff, staff, staff. Hire a new handyman. 
Now, one thing you always want to do in Rollercoaster Tycoon 1 is tell them to not mow the grass because it makes no difference and it will waste their entire time. Like, look at all this. This needs to all be mowed. They got rid of that in Rollercoaster Tycoon 2 and every game afterwards because it makes no sense. I don't want to mow the grass. <laughs> I want you to just, you know, do your thing. So we'll get one handyman and we'll get one mechanic because that's all we really need right now. Unfortunately, there's almost no one going on this ride. Uh, I'm not going to get the security guard or an entertainer yet. Let's keep building the coaster. Uh, thankfully, it kept the menu open, which is actually really nice. Hopefully, it can make that. And then we'll just do a bigger drop here. Uh, and then, can we do a... Uh, what if we do a big turn like this? And then, flat this way. Small turn. Hopefully this will work. I'm going to try and get this back to the station now. Although I've kind of... Uh, we need to go back this way anyway. Now, can I fit over this? I can. Thankfully. No, got to keep going flat. Actually, hang on. What we'll do... What we'll do... Go forward and up. And then, yeah, just a little, little bump. Little bump. Can that fit? No, it won't. Okay, that's fine. And then, so if I come around, go to there, go to there, that should be fine. Okay, that should be fine. So can we do a small helix down small? If that works. Whoops. Can I? There we go. Uh, small down. Yes. Good. Get rid of all these trees. And actually, can I just go down here? Yeah, cool. Flat. Then I think I'll do some breaks to. I don't know. If, I don't even know if we need breaks here, but we're going to put them in anyway. Uh, just because we're almost back at the station. And there we go. Right. So we're going to test that. Oh, we have to build an entrance before we can test it. That seems weird. Anyway, uh, do it there. Exit there. And let's go test. What? Thing on move, I can't see. Yeah, I know it's not complete, but can you move that? Oh, I see. It's let me build this, but not actually. Yeah, okay. That's weird that it let me build that. Hang on. We need to change this whole bit then, because that's not going to work. Yeah, that's weird, because I. We can go up, but if you go steep, it, it seems weird that it will let you do that, because you can see there it's not joined, but this is. Okay, so we got to try and hopefully this will join up. Uh. This could be interesting to try and get this to work. Okay, please tell me this will work. Oh no. Uh, okay, we've got to go back. Got to go here. Got to go up. Got to go flat. Got to go up. That's down. Up. That's not going to fit. That's not going to fit. Ah, uh, this is uh, throwing a little spanner in the works, hasn't it? Or a wrench, if you will. And then maybe if we go up sharp here. The problem is we need to be over there. Um, hmm. Yeah, this is not proved to be too easy. If we do that and then go down sharp. Okay. How about this? And then no, not a chain lift. I don't I don't want a chain lift. Hang on. Go back. And up. Here we go. Can't do that. I don't understand. Hang on. I need to go back to this one. We, yeah, we're underneath here. Okay. Oh, actually, hang on. If we go here, flat, bank, small, won't fit, down a little bit. Damn it. Okay, now we need to go down. Other way. Okay, this would fit. Obviously, we just got to try and join these two bits now. Yeah! Okay, let's try that. Oh my god. What is going on here? Oh, there's two trains. I don't know if we we're going we're gonna to need two trains, really. I think that's probably unnecessary, at least at this point. Yeah, they're, they're, they're dangerously close together. <laughs> this game did not have... Uh, did not have accurate uh, coaster 
goes to simulation. Okay, so far so good. Especially if this doesn't work and one gets stuck, this could be uh, this could be bad. Ooh. Oh no, I think we're good. I think we're good. <gasps> yes. Some brakes and it comes in gently to the station. Yeah, I don't think we need two trains. Let's go one. Uh, it must be closed. Okay, well, close. One train. And let's just do a test again. All right, while that's testing, let's get some pathways. Uh, so the queue is going to go this way, this way, this way, this way, this way. Because I imagine this is going to be a super popular ride. So, uh, See, ideally I want to go all the way down here and then come back. But the problem... <laughs> you'll see the problem there is that we, we can't. Uh, unless, can I... Can it, will it let me do this? How do you direction... I want to... No, no, no. I want to build with the... Ugh. Okay. Hang on. We're going to have to remove... Because I want to remove it all. Oh, I thought I could click and drag. Could not. Okay, you guys are going to be on the grass and probably lost. Presumably lost. Um, how do I rotate? Is there a hotkey to rotate? I don't, I don't know. Maybe. I don't know what it is. Okay. So. Okay. Here we go. What I want to do, just get this up here, a little bit extra in there, why not? There we go. And then this will come through. Okay. Good. Alright, so that will give people a way to get around. Um, and that gives us a nice long queue. It, it's a bit weird that it goes in there like that. <laughs> this person just walked into the queue. It's like, what's going on? Where am I? Ah. It's alright, it's alright, buddy. You'll be fine. You'll be fine. Alright, and then we have the exit there. Okay, so test should be complete. Oh, that's good. Intensity is pretty high, which is not bad. Uh, that's a good thing. About $4 we could probably charge. $4.20. $4.20! <laughs> oh, if I could actually click it. There we go. I'll charge probably about $4.20. Uh, Rollercoaster 1 can be... Oh, you, you can't see these windows that pop up, but anyway. Cat... Oh, God. How do you spell caterpillar? No, slug of... Slagathor. Is that how you spell Slagathor? I don't know. It's a slug of Slagathor. <laughs> it's probably none of that is probably spelt right. Uh, we haven't done any colors, which we should definitely do. Main color scheme, yellow. I think it should be green even, just to kind of blend in with the landscape a little bit, because it's supposed to be... It's going to be the slug of Slagathor. Those should be leaves, and that can be like trees. Oh, that's kind of cool. Uh, I think red is good for the, uh, the actual color of the coaster, though, so we'll go with that. This one... This park is looking very red, but you know what? Let's not worry about it. Oh, look at them all going on the Slug of Slagathor. Yes! They're loving it. They are loving it. All right, so we should have a few more rides as well, actually. There was someone else that just unlocked it. I'm not sure what that was. Um, so we've got a couple of those. Do we have another thing in here? Ah, yeah, we had the we had the circle ride. Also known as a Helter Skelter, I believe you'll find. Um, okay, let's get... Do we need more bench? Oh, there's a lot of people walking up here. Maybe it's the scenery. I think we should put something up here. Whether it's food or rides or what. I don't know. Let's get a ride up here. Uh, let's get... Maybe this. I don't know how fun this will be. Probably not very, but... There's a lot of people wandering around up here, so I want to take advantage of that. Get out of the tree. Get out of the tree! Get out of my way tree is what I meant. Get out of me tree! Way! Okay, this is going to be green. It's going gonna, it's gonna to match. It's going to blend in and look beautiful up here. Okay, that will just go like that. That's probably fine for this. I don't think this is going to be a huge ride. Maximum people on ride. Let's go five. Why not? Um, okay, so this is awaiting test results. Okay, well, I'll open it. I guess I have to wait for someone to go on it. I guess my janitor. My janitor. Oh, look at the people on this ride. They're loving it. Oh, they're screaming too. Yes. All right, so we're getting a bit of a queue now too. Look at this. There's so many people going on it. Right, so we've got this up here. Uh, hopefully they, so 184, 150, perfect. They already checked. Why would you pay a dollar fifty for that? Ah, <sighs> I don't know. People, people are people. Uh, let's get some bathrooms up here and all that. Let's go bathroom. Nope, there's a pillar in the way. Okay, never mind. I'll put it there then. Open that. Get a bathroom. Get some food up here too. Uh, which I'll put there. And we'll get some drinks. Which I'll put there. So you can come up. So this is like kind of a little plaza. You could come up, get some food, have a nice time, you know, all that kind of good stuff. Uh, I'm going to put the ice cream right next to the bathroom, but don't worry about it. It'll be fine. Uh, so we already have benches up here. I don't know about bins. I don't I don't seem to see any. So I think I might get some, uh, 
some bins up here, which if I can remember where to get them, they're right here. Uh, there we go. You got a couple there. Maybe there. Maybe there. Just around the place. There you go. Just so we have a bunch of them. And I think we'll get some more benches too. Because this is a this is a bit of a little bit of a food plaza, so you'd want to be able to sit down somewhere. All right, so there's some food because we have a lot of people walking up there for some reason. So we'll get some food. Oh, look at it! Not a full ride, but it should be making us some money. Good. We only have two thousand bucks left, so we really need to start getting some money. We have 135 guests in the park. This is still year one, May. Our goal was by year four to have a thousand people or something like that. So I think we're we're well on our way. That ride is looking very very good. I think I might have overdone the queue a little bit. <laughs> I think I made it a little too big, but that's okay. Let's get some more rides. Not another coaster yet. Uh, let's get the uh, the haunted house. That seems like a fun one. Uh, so we have a lot of people, obviously. A lot of people trekking up this main. A lot of people going over here too for some reason, which I don't really like. What we should do is definitely just connect these out. What? Hang on. Let's um. Let's reconfigure the part. I'm going to cut it off there. Put that in, cut it off there, and if they could stop walking down this way, that'd be ideal. But the problem is, I can't. I don't. I can't really do that. Uh, and then I'll rejoin there. I think that's joined it. Has it? Yeah. So they can now walk through here and get over that way. So they don't have to go all the way up the mountain and over. So that'll just give them a way to get through here, which we should definitely put some stuff in here. Uh, let's get the haunted house though. Let's build that. I think just over here. In this little area here. Seems pretty haunted here. Whoa, look at that. That's actually a really good spot for it. I like that. Uh, then we'll get the queue there. Exit. There. Perfect. Test it. Test all of our monsters. So we'll get the exit in. Good. Uh, haunted house. I'm thinking. Let's go yellow. Uh, so if we go like this. It's hard to see with so many trees in the way. But I think that should be good. Yeah, cool. Uh, so that is 245. Not bad. So if we charge two bucks, two bucks twenty. Let's go two ten. Ooh, lightning! Ooh, let's open that up. Haunted house one. Classic name for a ride. Uh, good. So we have some food there. We have food up top and a ride. A couple of rides over here. Haunted house. Uh, I think we could definitely use a coaster over here. We should definitely put something in here. The problem is the only thing we can put in there is more stores and all that. So I don't, I don't know if we really want to do that. Get a bathroom in there though, why not? It's always good to have those around the place. Uh, we should also get out maybe some food. Ugh, destroys the fence, damn it. That's annoying. Oh well, whatever. But we'll get some more food in here because I think we should, we should definitely have food and drink and all that all around the place. The more we have, the better. As long as we're not bleeding our money, then we're good. Uh, so I'll get this in. And I'm going to hire some more staff. I think I'll get another janitor because we're probably going to start... Just because the park is so big, we need more, more people. So we'll get, we'll get another couple, I think, and maybe one more mechanic. Still no entertainers or anything. That should be fine. Okay, so that should hopefully keep our park nice and clean. Oh, actually, uh, can I? I thought you could click on here to get rid of the um, task. I guess not. I, I guess you can just see what they're doing. Don't mow grass ever, because you'll waste all your time. Uh, new ride, steel roller coaster. Ooh. Ooh, well, look, we don't have a lot of money. We have 400 bucks, so I think we kind of need a... Oh, look at this. Look at this. Money, money, money. Yeah, we definitely didn't need two trains on this. You see all the money we just got as people went in there? Damn. Damn! Still losing money, though, but I think... If we have a look. Ride construction. Okay, let's ignore... Let's rule out ride construction. And even landscaping. So ride tickets plus 400. What we need to worry about is what we're spending money on. So research, we're spending a lot of money on research. Which I think... Might just go normal. Cut it in half. Because we need we need to actually earn money at some point. So, I mean, research is great and all, but we kind of need uh, money. So let's cut that out. Uh, let's go... So, hang on. What is, like, our ride running costs? 110. Then if we're spending 200 on freaking research, then we're only getting 400 from ride tickets. Maybe we should do a little bit less. Minimum 100. Otherwise, we're not going to be ever making any money. We'll just be breaking even. Which is not good. So, we, we want to try and earn money. Uh, good. So, we got uh, got a lot of people just wandering. We, had, we do have 200 people in the park. So, that's actually not bad at all. But we need more stuff. We need... 
Ooh, a seal roller coaster looks cool. Maybe we can get one of these, a merry-go-round. I think this is a nice little spot for it here. Don't know how we're going to fit entrance and exit in, but I think that's quite good. Uh, entrance. And then exit. All right, test that. Now, I think what I'll do... May not look as nice, but I'm going to get rid of these trees. No, no, no. The tr no, no. Oh, I don't have $15 to get rid of a tree? Ugh. God, I'm poor. Right, actually, Haunted House. We have a lot of people going here. Can I increase the number of people going in it? Capacity 15 guests. Because we actually have a surprisingly big queue for a freaking Haunted House. Of all the rides. Oh, here we go. Oh, no. So we get 15 in at a time. That's some good money. Two forty-five. dollars each spending $2.10 to get in there. These rides seem empty, but I think it's just because it's raining as well. You think more people would want to go on the coaster? Well, actually, what are they thinking about this? That's probably a good question. We haven't checked. Oh, yeah, not going on while it's raining. It looks too intense. Uh, okay. I mean, it's intense, but it's not, I don't think it was that bad. But I guess it's not really a junior coaster at the end of the day. Uh, <laughs> it's probably because... I'm thinking maybe even like this corner here where it goes down and sort of doesn't have any banking on that corner. That might be why. It's a little bit intense, but that's okay. All right, so we're not making any money right now. Uh, not great. Uh, I think... Uh, if, as long as we stay... Uh, we should be making money, though. But I think it's just because I spent 460 on the ride. $1. Here we go. Getting some money as they go into the haunted house. And then money going on the coaster as well. Can I, I actually might um, wait for full... Oh, yeah. Maximum waiting time 60 seconds. Fair enough. Okay. Looks like there's definitely more people going on it now that there's that it's not raining. And also because we have more people in the park too, so that's good. Here we go. Alright, so the coast is actually full at this point. I think I might even cut down the length of the queue. I think I I think I definitely overdid it there, but I don't know. Maybe we'll just leave it. Alright, so we have a bit of money now. Let's get rid of uh, these trees so I can get in the ride. Or get this ride open. I need to get a better view. Okay, so what I was going to do is go here, here, here. Maybe one more. Oh, 10 bucks again. Oh, I don't have $10. <laughs> when when you're a theme park and you don't have $10 to your name, that's kind of it's kind of sad. Uh it's a it's a sad time, you know. But that's okay. Uh, we we only do we only do our best. All right, get out of my way and put that there. Okay, so this should be out of open now. Hopefully people will go on this. I don't know that they will. A dollar 33. I guess we'll just charge a dollar 10. Charge a little bit more. No one's going on that. I saw them all walking away. Is it not fun enough? It's a really good value. Something more thrilling. Oh, well, some people will go on it. So, yeah, here we go. One person. It might not have been worth our time. Although, this area is starting to look very, very busy, which is good. Up here is looking... Surprisingly, quite a few people going on this ride, too. Uh, actually, let's have a look. Total profit... Uh, profit per hour, 436. Total profit, 74. Not bad. Uh, 551... Total profit per hour, 3,000. Good, good. So that is making... As long as everything's making money, I think, is kind of the important thing. That's not. Uh, <laughs> oh, wow. Yeah, the Haunted House makes a lot of money per hour. Although, there's no one else in the queue anymore, so I don't know if it's slowed down. But total profit, 115. Not bad. Not bad at all. We are at minus... It's, we're, hot, we're really hovering around sort of minus profit at the moment, which is not good. Landscaping. Yeah, because we removed all the trees. Ride running costs. Park entrance tickets is, yeah, nothing, obviously. Uh, ride tickets, all-time high in June here. Not bad. But then we're spending staff wages, 107 so far. So I guess that's where a lot of money's going. And, uh, well, at least we've, we've cut down research. It means we'll get less rides. But I think until we, uh, until we have enough money, we can't really do much about that. Um, good, look at this. Look at this queue. This is good. This is what I want to see. This is what I want to see. I wonder if we can bump up the price a little bit. Oh, 430. No, I don't think we will be able to. Uh, that's good. That's really good. I'm really, I'm really happy with this. I don't think anyone's going on this, though. I think this might have been a waste of money. Our total profit is $3.50. That's not good. <laughs> that's not good. Surprisingly, that's not good. Uh, all right. Look at this. That is... Oh. That makes me happy. That makes me happy. All right, let's have a look at something else we could do. Uh, really want 
Oh, thrill ride. So what I actually might do is jump over to research and focus on thrill rides for a bit. Until we get an, a new thrill ride, I think we'll put our research into that. So we did get minus 256 this month, but that's if we didn't build the ride, we would have made a profit. I mean, it's better than minus 3,000. We could take out more of a loan, but I don't... I don't want it. I want it. I just... Oh, oh, this game is so good. This game is so good. I do love it. <laughs> I think I think I'll leave it here though. I think I'll leave it here. I think we've had a good go. The coaster is starting to do really, really well. Uh, you know, we got our little what is it? Scrambled eggs one. Whatever. Uh <laughs> Merry Go Round Haunted House is doing pretty well. Uh where's my health skelter? There it is. Or slide one. Also also doing pretty well. I think I'll leave it here though. I mean if you guys are interested in this, we can always do more. But uh I think it was it was really nice to just come back to this and have a go at it. And I think this is awesome. And yeah, I'm glad we didn't if you if you Trust me, if you let people wander around this whole park, they will never go on your rides. You really need to contain it to where your park is. See, I mean, look, they're wandering down here and there's nothing here. That's why we need to build something up there. But uh, yeah, let me know if you want to see more or anything like that. Because I'm glad to do it because this game is great. But thanks for watching, guys. I will see you next time. And have an awesome day.